Hi hello guys welcome to a new video on forearm pneumonics in the previous video we have seen the pneumonics on hand muscles in the sequence of upper limb if you didn't watch that video the link is in the description kindly watch the video in the forearm muscle if you know what is forearm muscle you can directly skip to this duration to see the pneumonics if you don't know or if you just want a quick recap on this topic just follow me if you take forearm muscle there are almost 20 muscles engaged in this Forearm muscles can be subdivided into anterior compartment and posterior compartment. Under anterior compartment, we have 8 muscles and under posterior compartment, we have 12 muscles. These 12 muscles will be discussed on the part 2 of this video and we will be discussing about 8 muscles of this. These 8 muscles can be further divided into superficial muscles, deeper muscles. Superficial muscles are the muscles. If this is anterior compartment, this is posterior compartment. If you take anterior compartment, you take out the first group of muscles appearing on the outer surface are and superficial muscles and the muscles under the superficial muscles are deeper muscles. Okay, under superficial muscle we have five muscles and under deeper muscle we have three muscles. Okay, what are the five muscles and three muscles? Just remember these five and three with only two simple statements. The statement for superficial muscle is filling curd in stomach promotes less problems today. The statement is filling curds in stomach promote less problem today. And we have five muscles. Let us see what are these muscles. The first muscle is for first F right flexor and for C right carpi and for you right ulnaris the first muscle is flexor carpi ulnaris second muscle is again f flexor c carpi instead of u take r radialis and for the third muscle is again f flexor here instead of u and r take ds whereas d stand for digitorum s stand for superficialis and now the fourth muscle is this one promotes less P stands for palmaris L stands for longus and finally problems today here P stands for pronator T stands for teres so that's all so these are the five muscles of superficial here this uh, simple additional statement pronator helps in the process of pronation so this is a simple statement for remembering superficial muscle. Now let's move to deeper muscles. For the three deeper muscles, just remember one single statement called finding deli polis private long is easy in polis quartus. So the simple statement gives us the all the muscles of deeper layer of anterior compartment. The first muscle is F stands for flexor, D stands for digitorium, P stands for profundus. Second muscle is again F stands for flexor, P stands for pollicis, L stands for longus. The final muscle is P stands for pronator, Q stands for quadratus. So just for an extra knowledge, again here pronator quadratus muscle helps in process of pronation. And the muscle that helps for supination comes into action of posterior compartment of forearm muscle. So this is the mnemonic, simple mnemonic on forearm muscles, anterior compartment. Keep subscribed and keep updated for getting posterior compartment and rest of the muscles of upper limb. Thanks for watching.